Oh, right. Can I actually call a meeting? Oh, we have a quorum? What am I talking about? I guess not. I don't think we have a public hearing, do we? Oh. But there's not an agenda item here. I put I put it on IBA when I make my certification. So IVA oh four? Yeah, that Okay. Right, and by the way, it says that Okay, we're gonna call this meeting to order. Sorry we're late. Uh, uh, Jan and I were backstage jabbering around talking about issues. Um Wait, am I good, good here? All right. Uh, so we're going to go straight to um, election business, certification of official results by the city secretary. I've got a phone. Sorry. Okay, mayor and council, um, is this working? Yeah. You have now received tabulations of the official returns from Tarrant County elections for the election held on Saturday, May 1st, 2021, for the purpose of electing city council places one, three, and five. In this election, 1,245 valid and legal votes were cast, of which 692 were cast early and 553 were cast on election day. The certified cumulative returns are reported as follows. For City Council Place 1, Jan Joplin received 642 votes. Josh Altum received 566 votes. For Place 3, Chris Pugh received 513 votes and Julie Jacobson received 654 votes. And for City Council Place 5, Chad Wandell received 452 votes, Stacy A. Golden received 312 votes, and James Connor received 316 votes. As a result of these tabulations, it would appear that the following are hereby elected. Jan Joplin, City Council Place 1, Julie Jacobson, City Council Place 3. For Place 5, as no candidate received a majority of the vote, a runoff election is scheduled for Saturday, June 5th, 2021, with Chad Wandell and James Connor appearing on the ballot. Early voting will be May 24th through June 1st. I would now ask for a motion acknowledging Council's receipt of the certification of these official returns for the election held Saturday, May 1st, 2021, and approving that they be filed within the city's election register as page 75. You have a motion? I'd like to make that motion. Second. Okay. All right, then all, all those in favor, please raise your hand. And most, motion passes unanimously. Uh, item two, consider approval of resolution canvassing the returns and declaring the results of the general election on May 1st for the purpose of electing council members one, three, and five for the city of Kennedale. So anybody wanna make a move to approve resolution 587? So moved. We have a second. Second. All those in favor, please raise your hand. Motion passes unanimously. Why do I have meetings like this? Next up, oath of office for Jan Joplin, place one. Jan, you gonna pop on up? Uh, no, I have to see right down here since uh, we got this window and let her come around there. Yes, you can.
Okay. Um, did the oath of office, and then under one, uh, I think John Havali wishes to speak. You've got three minutes. Ready? Name and name and address. That's uh, one minute addition. No. <laughs> <laughs> it's 15 but seconds, I, but go ahead. Now it's 20 seconds. Yeah, yeah. But anyway, um, that, I, think, I think it's important to do that because in citizens who don't participate, it's their fault because they can complain well. Well, come and complain over here. So that's uh, the citizens that are listening. If you want to complain, come to your city council member, come to your mayor, come to your city administration officials. So I wish the best as we move forward here. And hopefully if this fell on somebody's ears, that it got listened and noted. Thank you and have a great afternoon. Thank you, John. All right, so the last thing we need um, is just a motion to adjourn. That's the only thing we have left on the agenda. Dan, you want to make a motion to adjourn? Julie, you want to second it? All right. <laughs> Any further discussion? I hope not. All those in favor, raise your hand. Look at that. That's unanimous, folks. Keep an eye on those. Thanks, everybody. See you later. Hey, John.